What's up? This is your boy Kenny B. I'm finna do a tutorial to show you how to put gun skin on your Glock. Stay with me. I'll be right back and I'm gonna give you the instructions how to do it so you can beautify your gun. Here we go, player. This is a Glock 17. Uh, I love this. This is my 38 Taurus. Uh, beautiful gun. Hard hitting both of them recalls perfect but before we put the skin on we must we must clean the gun first you know what i'm saying uh this is the skin that i'm using i don't endorse these people i don't know them like that this is the first time I'm using so gun skin gun skins is somewhere you can buy the decals and put on the guns or whatever so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna clean my barrel first so this is what how i clean my barrel i get some gun cleaner and i make sure that I wipe it down really, really good so it can, you know, get all the extra gunpowder and all that other stuff. Uh, then I go and get a brush. This is a kit I got from my anniversary or whatever. And I brush out everything with a good clean and make sure no residue or nothing is all around. So I clean it gun. <laughs> Secondly, I start adding the skin. Yeah, I'm gonna add the, the gun skin to this. So neatly and carefully, I'm gonna use it. Then I'm gonna use like a heat gun or a blow dryer. You know, some people don't have blow dryer. I mean, heat guns, but I have a blow dryer. You know, we live in LA, you know, bed bugs or some shit like that come around. I wanna kill the bed bugs, you know what I'm saying? So I get a heat gun for my bed bugs. But uh, as I'm folding and pulling, uh, as it's sticking, I'm, I'm also squeezing it with a cord or something to get the edges, to get the, the ridges and stuff of the slide to be uh, almost looking like it's it's one piece, right? So as I'm pulling and heating and pulling and heating, you know what I'm saying, I'm straightening out, making sure no bubbles in it and all that, you know, uh, which is smoothing over, you know what I mean? And as it's laying on both sides, as you can see, uh, no wrinkles nothing i'm using one hand pretty much so now i have to use a, a zacto knife or some type of razor you know what i'm saying to make sure you get the edges is uh clean and you know the access extra shit you know what i'm saying that you don't need or uh, because that adhesive will make your gun kind of you know stick when you cop it back or whatever but don't forget to make sure you get into those little edges and stuff throughout the gun or whatever but like I said, make sure you have like a towel to press down, you know, so it ain't so much of it's hot or anything. You don't want it to get it real, real hot or nothing. You just want it to warm up, to loosen up so you can be able to uh, make it structure the shape or whatever indication of the gun. And as you can see, you got make sure you, the dispensary part where the shells come out, you got to cut that out too. You don't want no access on that because that'll make your gun kind of jam up a little bit too so now we're in the end stages of this and uh i'm cutting out the sights the sights is kind of hard because it's lifting up and it don't want to stick so once you cut it out then hit it with the heat gun and come back it's going to stick uh better than what it was when it's lifting up you know what i'm saying and not cut yet so uh, but other than that it was an easy job to do man uh I actually went and did uh, my 38 and I did the the handprints of that. But you see how nice that looked? That is so nice. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. So now this is my son's uh, BB gun. <laughs> uh, look at that. Really, really nice. Really, really nice. So not to leave my son now, I had to make sure that his BB gun, uh, which is a Glock 17 as well, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Be decaled as well, you know what I'm saying? So. Uh, you can have fun with this and make sure, you know, uh, you practice safety laws all the time. You know what I'm saying? But uh, you want to add something to make your gun look a little bit more different and better. You know, shit, man. Personalize it. Shit, man. Go out to these people right here. And, you know, 20 bucks, man. Shit, you can get you a sheet of this and do what you want to do. They got other designs and shit like that. I just chose this. Uh, I'm not into the red, white, and blue shit, you know what I'm saying? But I'm definitely into uh, <laughs> my black peopleness. <laughs> Love y'all, man. I'm out. Beats by. Brought to you by.